Which I'm glad. <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> Hello my beautiful babies! Welcome back again to my channel! And if this is the first time you're here, well then welcome back. My name is Joe Gomez and I am mostly a self-taught makeup artist. In this channel, we love everything that has to do with beauty and makeup. So if you like or if you're into that kind of content, consider subscribing. Here we have new content. My channel has become mainly a Spanish-speaking channel, but occasionally I just love to throw in the makeup one or two or more videos in English just because I know that also you enjoy those videos and I have so much fun watching those and also recording and filming this so I'm gonna keep doing them don't worry about that and maybe in the future I'm gonna have a second channel with English videos and tutorials and all that stuff but in the meantime just please enjoy this one welcome back consider subscribing don't forget activate the notification bell so every single time that I will be uploading new YouTube videos, YouTube in charge will let you know that I've done so. Also follow me on other social media platforms where you can find me as Joe Gomez Beauty on Instagram, TikTok, and as Joe Gomez Beauty one on Twitter. The one and only my beautiful baby. I'm trying little by little to be a little bit more active over there and I promise y'all that I'm gonna do it. Just please bear with me. But today we're celebrating something special. What could it be more special than celebrating your birthday? But Hold your horses, hold it bro, hold it sis. Today, we're gonna be talking about everything that I bought to celebrate my birthday. So yeah, this is gonna be my first YouTube haul where I'm gonna be showing you all of the things that I bought as a present, as gifts to myself. It's so important to auto-celebrate yourself and always pampering yourself and just feel good about yourself. And I don't know, I just love to buy things for any reason. So don't worry about that. I'm still gonna buy my things. But right now, this is my birthday month. When you're gonna be watching this, it's gonna be March. Probably my birthday will have past by that time you'll be watching this because my birthday is on March the 2nd. But either way, I'm super excited to be here and just share with all of you everything that I got that is just like beauty, makeup related, and a little bit of a clothing haul of things that I got to celebrate myself and spoil myself and just celebrate myself. If I buy something else, because I did buy a few extra items, I'm gonna be showing them to you over Instagram on stories, or maybe if I have the time, I'm gonna be filming another clip so let's get started let's just get to it baby so here I have my box of all of the goodies that I just got for myself but the first thing that I want to talk about actually is gonna be the clothing items because I want to film a video that's gonna be so special to actually celebrate my birthday you're gonna be watching that video soonish I guess as soon as I get the clothes because honestly I still haven't gotten them and I'm super excited about getting those clothes so some things from Shein so I'm so excited about that and I can't wait to show you. Confirmation of your order. So, what did I get from she and my beautiful babes? The first thing that I got, so they have 20% off today. That's good. First thing that I got, it was some sort of a dress. It was some sort of a dress. I'm so excited about that one because it's this beautiful blazer with loose sleeves that you can see and it has this beautiful belt in the middle of it with a huge buckle in the middle. It looks so beautiful and stunning. So I'm going to be wearing that in one of the upcoming videos. And of course, baby, you can wear a dress. This is sort of like a blazer. It's the perfect mix between between a blazer but also it is a dress that's why I loved it so much but it really frames your body you know that my body is a little bit more let's say thick <sighs> I'm a thick girl and I'm also kind of muscly girl because I do lift some weights so that's the reason why and sometimes I look a little bit boxy because my hips are not so wide but my shoulders are so what I try to do every single time is just to look for something that's gonna balance me out black balances you out it makes you look slimmer or thinner that's something that I always love about wearing black but I wanted something that cinched my waist that I could really adjust and really really behave 
living super well with my diet and my habits and the exercise and everything so I just hope that I'm gonna be able to fit into dress because I got the size extra large because I'm large and in charge <laughs> so yeah my beautiful babes I got that one and of course if you're gonna be wearing a dress honey you need some high heels and then I got this beautiful, beautiful pair of high heels. You're going to be seeing those on the screen. And these are just gorgeous. I mean, I'm like, oh my God, look at those shoes. These are so beautiful. Yeah, these are the shoes. These are like um, really high palms with an open toe. I love that. And they're high. they're high. They have this sort of like a bracelet. The bracelet is crossed. They look comfortable. And I think I'm going to be able to walk in those because I have a pair of boots that I just got last December from Stuart Weitzman or Westies at Liverpool, a Mexican clothing store here in Mexico and they were comfortable but they were super super high so I just hope that I'm gonna be able to walk in this. Either way I'm not gonna be using them to go anywhere soon but I just want to be prepared. You never know what if a date comes up and a cute guy asks me out so I have to be ready and I have to have my super hot and sexy outfit and then the last thing that I got when it comes to clothing for myself is a pair of stockings and these are fishnet stockings but they have small crystals in them you're gonna be seeing them here in the screen I would have loved to show you the real deal like the actual items but I still haven't gotten my order yet you know that with Shein it's always like that they take a little bit extra because all of their products I believe they come from China so they take a little bit longer my beautiful babes this fishnet stockings they're everything they're the shade nude so i think that that's gonna give me nice volume on my legs because my legs are kind of thin they're like muscly but i have a problem in one knee so one of my legs has gotten a little bit thinner than the other one that's horrible i know maybe i'm gonna be needing surgery soon so that's gonna be super sad but i don't know i want to have something that adds a little bit of extra volume on my legs and i think that that's gonna look super super nice that's it when it comes to clothing i didn't get as much as i would have wanted to because of course my budget was a little bit limited and also we have another box of actual items that i'm going to be showing to you and honey these were pricey as well so the other thing that i got were two glitters i got one that is the glitter wizard invisible jelly shadow a lot of people are talking about those they're sort of like euphoria inspired so i cannot wait to try that out in an euphoria inspired makeup or just for fun it says here that you can wear this glitter all over your body on your hair on your skin on your eyes on your face so that's super exciting to me and then i got another one that was from the christmas collection and this one is sort of like holographic see-through and i'm just looking for the perfect holo glitter because i want to put it on top of a lot of different eyeshadows and just see the way that it's going to look on top of other eyeshadows and if it's going to change the color the other item that i got was this face and under eye setting powder Powder duo this is the famous or infamous powder duo that came out last year as well this is a specifically targeted powder for your under eye area it says that it's gonna blur everything it's gonna make it look super bright super nice nourish hydrated all together super beautiful so I couldn't wait and I couldn't resist TikTok made me do it and I had to try it out and I also got the face powder you know that it's a duo but I honestly I honestly do not remember the shade that I got mine in so we're gonna have to wait and see I think it's sand or shell something like that and then last but not least an eyeshadow palette but I'm not gonna be talking about too much about that one because I have planned a super cool video that I want to film for all of you maybe that video actually is gonna be in English I'm still debating on that we're gonna have to wait and see but yes I did get an eyeshadow palette from Shein and I'm super excited to see if the quality is gonna be good if the quality 
is gonna be there this palette I can tell you that a lot of people say that it's a dupe for a very high-end brand so I just cannot wait for that if it's gonna deliver if it's gonna be as good as people said it's that's it when it comes to Shein those were the things that I got but now let's move on to the makeup and the things that I do have in my little box like I said before this one I presented to you in another video this is a perfume that I got from Oriflame Sweden this is in the shade in the shade this is Divine by Oriflame Sweden. As you can see, I've been using this one during the week and it's already, it's going down really quick. Because it's just so delicious. So delicious, my beautiful babes. I love this one. I think it's just like super, mm, it smells so divine. <laughs> like its name it's super delicious this is from oriflame this wasn't so expensive but you know that nowadays perfumes tend to be super pricey another thing that i got at the supermarket here in mexico was my neutrogena hydro boost hydrating water gel and i love this one so so much i use it especially on the days when i'm gonna be doing my makeup for youtube for special occasions or on clients i usually get the jumbo jar but i just run out of that one and i needed a bag up and I got this one. This one here in Mexico is a little bit bright, beautiful babes, but let's move on. So that's the moisturizer that I got. It's worked wonders on my skin, so that's why I keep using it because I like it so, so much. Neutrogena Hydro Boost. Then, a lot of the products that I'm going to tell you about next, you're seeing them already on my face because actually this was my last Spanish video and this was me trying a full face of Essence makeup. Essence is one of my favorite drugstore makeup brands it's just so good so affordable here in Mexico is affordable but it's just not super affordable like I believe it is in the States so there's that I'm not gonna give you any particular order I just got these items and that's it this is the bronze this way eyeshadow palette you're seeing it on my face so divine and amazing I really like this one then I also got the bronzer way bronzer palette this one is just gorgeous I can tell you that this is really really good quality Quality. and this one is a dupe alert of Hula Benefit Hula from Benefit both light and also the regular Hula it's just so gorgeous I got two glosses this one these are the shine 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 wet look lip gloss and these are the ones that I got I got one in no-brainer and this one in behind the scenes these are so gorgeous and beautiful you're seeing one of them on my lips right now let's just a little, a little bit more. Mm. It's just so good. It smells so divine, like almost like a cupcake. I don't know. The smell is just really, really good. The foundation. This is the Estelle Day 16 Hour Foundation. It's long lasting foundation, vegan, waterproof, transfer resistant. It's just so good. I really like that one. You're seeing it on my face back again. The Keep It Perfect Makeup Fixing Sprays Hydrating with Hyaluronic Acid. This one is just so good to set and refresh your makeup. I really enjoyed it as well. This mascara, the Lash Princess Mascara, the Falsies Effect. This is the first time that I got one of Essence mascaras and honestly I'm not disappointed at all. To the point that I decided not to wear Falsies today for today's videos and I'm super excited about that. That means that this mascara was just good and delivered. Delivered. So if you haven't tried this, my beautiful babe, you should go and get yours because this is just so good. This is hot fire. Let me tell you that. I got three liners. One is for lippies this is a lip liner in the shade heavenly this one was not my particular favorite but mm, i mean it's okay for the price it's okay and then i also got this good gel eyeliner this is the inner eye brightening pen and the other one is the good gel pencil so this one is for your inner rim and this one is just like outside or all over i guess i didn't get to try those because the look they didn't match the look that much so i'm gonna be saving those for another occasion the last two products that i got from essence was of course the lipstick this is the this is me in the shade 02 happy this is such a gorgeous shade this is the one that i'm wearing on my lips and the more that i see it the more that i like it this is just not a color that i would have gone for so easily but now that it's on my lips i really really did enjoy it and with a look with the glass on top looks gorgeous then i got this essence all about matte fixing compact powder 
powder this is translucent but it doesn't leave a white cast it's super comfortable sets your makeup beautifully and you can also retouch your makeup on the go so this is ideal to carry on your pores i loved it i think it's such a beautiful gorgeous powder i really do think that that is a gem then i'm planning another video that is gonna be a full face but that's gonna be a full face of milani and i just got so many so many things from milani that i really don't even know where to start but i'm gonna go just fast track because i have so many things to talk about and look at this these are all the lipids that i got from milani I got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, because one, I got a duplicate. <laughs> Silly me, I just got two glasses of the same shade. But these are the ludicrous lip glosses. Two of them belong to a collection that it was the ludicrous lights. And these are two of them. One of them is in the shade Pink Guru, and the other one is in Pichella. Both of them super original, the shades. Take a look at them, these two. And then from the regular line, I got three different shades. One of them is a repeat, so I'm not going to show you that one. But these are in the shades Luster Light, is this one over here so fly this one over here and whatever this one is really nude with golden reflex the other two are sort of like this is a matte plus and this one is sort of like multi-chrome this is like champagne with a very nice golden reflex looks so absolutely beautiful i cannot wait to try that one out then i got this eye topper this is in pichella from the same collection ludicrous lights and i'm so intrigued about this one this one has a very very nice reflex on the eyes i'm not gonna be showing you swatches just yet because i'm planning to do a full face of course where i'm gonna be trying if not all of them a bunch of these products then i got some lip toppers i love lip toppers they can be so reflective and beautiful and i got myself three these are from the collection hypnotic lights and i just got one in the shade luminous lights shade four shade one but this one does not have a sticker so i don't really know i think this is luster light too this is luster light this is so fly no this is luminous light this too and then i got this one in the shade 0606 and this is electrolyte this is almost like a wine burgundy shade these are so beautiful and i also love the cap on them it has a lot of glitter super reflective and stunning it's just gorgeous last but not least for my lips i got these two beautiful lipsticks take a look at the shades there we go one of them is in tropical nude and the other one is in nude cream and these are the color statement lipstick in the shade 26 and 86 i'm gonna show you the way they look this is the other they feel so luxurious and so beautiful on the cap i have a lot of different lip products from milani that's for sure let's move on with two more lip products that i also got as treatment and this is gonna be the keep it sweet sugar lip scrub zero two sugar sweet this is the one that i got take a look at it the jar looks super super good it looks like really really nice size it's completely sealed because i haven't tried it yet and i'm not planning to until that video then we have the sugar smooth in keep it smooth luxe lip treatment and this is like a lip mask this looks so beautiful as well this is like the perfect companion or the complement so you can have both first of all you're gonna exfoliate your lips and then you're gonna have the lip treatment one of them has has six grams the treatment and the exfoliant has 12 grams of products so okay interesting 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 then i got this milani conceal plus perfect shine proof powder and this is in the shade natural light shade three mine came a little bit damaged over here but this is the shade i think it's gonna match me super perfectly and this one it says that it's lightweight powder that's gonna help your skin to stay shine free it's buildable coverage for a flawless finish magnifying bamboo powder absorbs oil and calming lily extract tightens the look of wars so 
interesting. I'm really, really interested about trying this one out. Actually, right now, one of my favorites is from a Mexican brand, but I can't wait to try this one out. Then I got this Prep and Suit Camellia Face Oil. This is from Camellia Flower. This one here, Melanie as well. This one is really, really good. The consistency, I poured a little bit, a few drops on my hand and I was just like shocked about how hydrating this one is. Plus the bottle is super luxe, it's just so beautiful. It comes with a pump on top of it. So you can use this one as a treatment or on, on your body as well to hydrate and moisturize. Or also you can use this one as a primer. Sometimes I have a lot of dry patches on my skin and I love to try this one out. When my skin is going through a rough time, this is gonna be really, really good, my beautiful babes. Then I got this, I'm super curious about this, powder this is the kimchi shake pop pop pass powder it says that it's a set and big powder so i'm super curious about that because if it says that it's going to be special to to do baking with it i'm going to be super super shocked the presentation is just gorgeous it comes in this wrapping paper that is just gorgeous and this is how you get the powder is this one over here it says kimchi shake, kimchi shake on the cap pop pop pass, set and bake powder in PPP 03 translucent. And of course, I wanted to get mine in translucent so that I can bake with it. They also have the banana shade, and that was the other shade that I that I saw on the website. But if they have another one, I'm gonna be super curious to see which shade is it, if it's gonna be lavender or I don't know, if it performs well, I'm gonna get another one. I'm gonna get another one in a different shade because I'm just super curious about that one. Then the next thing that I got was this Lore Salon Formula Nail Color. Lore is a German brand. They are so good. They dry so fast on, on the nails, like every single time you put them on, you just wait for a few seconds and then they're just dry. So these are just so good. This is gonna be my second one. My sister gave me this. this is my favorite shade this is almost gone it's it's halfway through this is in the shade wedding day and i believe yeah this is the same formula this is like hollow and this is like hollow with silvery reflex i love this one so much and i just got myself a new one so so happy about that christmas for the win <laughs> We're almost halfway through, my beautiful babes. I got this primer by Beauty Creations, and this is gonna be the color based primer. Dare to be bright in Ballerina Girl. You know that I love this one so, so much. I've used it almost every single look. I used it today because I didn't have an Essence eyeshadow primer. And then I also talked about and raved about these eyebrow pencils by Lore. These are just so good. They come with a very nice pulley. The formula is super creamy. This is almost like a pencil pomade, like I like to call it. These are so good. They're German, super good quality. I got one in light brown and also another one in medium brown just because sometimes I like to look a little bit blondish or a little bit more blonde and then some other times I love to have a more structured brow with a medium one. So these are really good, really pigmented. They set super quickly, so you do have to work with them with your spoolie. These are just some of my favorites. Right now, I think I'm gonna be going with the one from Essence. I forgot to show you this one. I also got this Essence Eyebrow Pencil. This is just so good as well. It's a little bit waxy, but it's very easy to work with. And this is the one that I used to do my eyebrows today. So you be the judges and let me know if you liked it or not. Now, I got two liners from Milani. I got a waterproof pencil, stay put waterproof pencil hooked on espresso. It's a shade espresso, of course, but I'm super curious about that. I want to see if it's going to be like super, super creamy. It's going to glide super easily, super fast on my lids because I love to use that kind of shade. You know, for a smoky eye, I just love to do a wing, brown mascara, smudge it a little bit. You're good to go. You're going to look glam and beautiful. So that's why I got it. And then I also got a wingy, a vinyl eye tech extreme in shiny black. Hmm, I thought that this one was going to be mad, but I don't mind, you know. This is gonna be good either way. And it says eye tech extreme vinyl liquid eyeliner lasts all day, dries super quick, transfer proof. So we will see about this one, my beautiful babes. What else did we get? So many things, right? I know I feel like 
floor. I got another liner, but this one is a lip liner, and this is in the shade Transparent. Believe it or not, this is a transparent lip liner, and I'm just super curious. This is the anti feathering lip liner in the shade 01 Transparent. It says that it's colorless for mistake proof application. Prime lips by filling in to the extent to wear off any lipstick or lip gloss. Moisturizing formula for creamy application and paraben free. We will see about those claims. Sounds like magical to me, you know? And then I also got the Milani eyeshadow primer. This one I read so many different reviews, and a lot of people were saying that this one is hot fire, is the real deal. This one promises over eight hour wear, lightweight, non sticky texture, minimizes creasing, blend well all over eyelid, and allow to set for 30 seconds. Hmm, what we'll see about this one. Eight hours of eyeshadow wear, sign me in. I'm in it to win it. Then I got this concealer in the shade Fair. This is the Recharge Any Race Light Lifting Concealer. Super interesting as well. This is the package that it comes in. This is from Milani as well. It says that it's quick and buildable coverage, color corrects through light technology, minimizes the look of dark shadows and wrinkles, blends easily, won't grease or settle into fine lines. Super curious about this one. I got this one in the shade Fair and I also got it in the shade Light. This is pale and this is light. I would have wanted to get the conceal and the conceal and perfect, something like that, but that one was a little bit pricey. Because Milani here in Mexico is pricey, my beautiful babes. Also, I believe that in the States it's a little bit pricey as well. I mean, for a drugstore brand, it's a little bit pricey. This is the Milani Mattifying Primer, the No Pore Zone. Super excited about this one. I love the presentation. Looks super, super luxe. And this one has Lily in Van bamboo extracts it blurs imperfections works for all skin tones and is designed to extend makeup wear lightweight silky texture matte finish enhanced with lily and bamboo extracts so i'm going to try this one too i'm so excited you know that i love to spoil myself for my birthday last year for my birthday i got my first uh, large palette from Natasha Denona, the Circle Loco, the Love Palette, and also the Love, the Love Glow Chicken Palette from Natasha Denona too. And I just believe that when it's your birthday, you have to go for it. You have to spoil yourself because you only live once. So, honey, just go for it. I got myself a new Revlon eyelash curler. This one is just so good. This one is my favorite. This one is drugstore, super affordable, highly, highly recommended, especially if you have um, deep set eyes my eyes are not so deep set but they are a little bit so this one works for me beautifully and I got myself a loose highlighting powder a mega glow wet and wild loose highlighting powder in the shade all grown up <laughs> I love the shade name, all blown up. This is the shade, this is very bronzy. I don't know if this is gonna work on me because this one looks a little bit copperish, but we'll make it work, you know me. So, excited about that. And speaking about highlighters and just like luminous powders, I got myself not one, but two of the Milani Radiant Powder. This is the Make It Last setting powder, but this is in the shade Radiant. My beautiful babes, this is one of my makeup hacks. This powder is just so beautiful. You can use it as highlighter. I wouldn't recommend to apply this one all over the face, or if you want to apply it all over the face, you have to go with a light hand because this one is pigmented, super bright, super, super, super bright, but it's just so beautiful. It gives you this very nice glow from within you can use it on your face on your body on your decolletage trust me this is gonna give you a very nice high-end finish this is one of my best kept secrets that i'm sharing with all of you right now because i just love it like that then for complexion, I got two foundations. I got myself the Wet n Wild foundation in the shade 2, I believe, 366C. But I don't know if the shade is right. I still see it a little bit warm or warmer for my complexion. You know that I love a deep, a deeper foundation on me, but this one looks a little bit pinkish. So, and it said on the website that it was shade number two, natural. So I'm just gonna go for it and pray for 
the best then i got this one this is the fresh and bright drug foundation this is from lower this one claims to be a little bit lightweight and for this month whenever it's going to be super hot out there because of the spring i think that this one is going to be super super good so i love that this one comes with a dropper so i think that that's going to be super nice and i'm going to be trying this one out and retrying this one out because this is my second one i have another one but in a deeper shade so i just wanted to have something a little bit more true tone to my skin tone you know i got two makeup setting sprays from milani 2 and these are the make it dewy setting spray this one it says that hydrates illuminates and sets 16 hour wear i'm super curious about this too i got two because like i said they were on sale so whenever on sale baby you need a backup <laughs> So I wanted to try this one so, so badly, even though this one is a little bit smaller. I thought that it was going to be a little bit bigger, but it's not. But I just love Milani, the presentation, my beautiful babes, like super, super luxe. It gives me full makeup forever vibes. This one, gorgeous. It looks so good. It says 3 in 1, hydrates, illuminates, and sets. Lightweight spray, luxe in makeup, up to 16 hours, refreshing effect, and a healthy looking glow. So interested about this. Can't wait to film that Milani video, by the way. You're gonna be seeing it very, very soon. Two more things, two more things over here. I got, we're almost done, I promise. This is the Milani Day Glow Luminous Stroke Light Instant Glow Powder in the shade 2. This one over here. This is the shade, it's like champagne, champagne gold really beautiful really really beautiful i love the presentation it comes with directions in the back i loved it and ever since i tried those bronzers from wet and wild i was just in love with the wet and wild color icon bronzer and now i got this one in the ticket to brazil shade take a look at this one it's just so beautiful i want to do also a full face of wet and wild so just hold on to that because i'm just gathering the products at this point i have foundation i have eyeshadows bronzer but i still need to have more complexion products i, I want to get some brushes too the guys from the company or the website that i got my products from they gave me this palette as a gift and i'm just so happy this was one of my gifts and this is the wet and wild color icon rose in the air these are so beautiful these are like so neutral wearable mauvey burgundy you know that i love the shade so much so i think that i'm gonna be making a huge use out of this eyeshadow palette take a look at the color scheme it's just so beautiful i love this one then i got this ludicrous lights milani Pichelam duo chrome highlighter this is gorgeous as well i mean i don't know if you can see this glow on the screen so beautiful it's very glittery and i just hope that this is not an overlay spray that they just put on top i'm really Really praying that the entire color or the entire product looks like this in person. This is just take a look at that. Oh my god, this is just gorgeous. I cannot wait to crack it open and just see. Speaking about highlighters, the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder in the shade Precious Petals. This one I saw a Mexican YouTuber speaking a lot about this one, so I was just like super curious and I was like, I need to try that one out. It looks so bomb, so beautiful. And if a lot of people are raving about this one, it it's because it's good then i got myself a very small blush from milani this is the romantic rose rose powder blush these are the iconic milani blushes that come in a rose shape these are so beautiful but this is like the mini version so to try out the formula i think that this is gonna be a great addition my beautiful babes can't wait to try this one out as well so last but not least I got, before speaking about the two palettes that I got, I got this Prep Setting Glow Illuminated Transparent Powder. I'm super curious about this one. This is in the shade 2. So, what we'll see about this powder. It looks weird. It says Illuminating Transparent Powder. It doesn't say anything else about this one. But it says, wear under foundation to prep skin over to lock in makeup. And it has a luminescent finish. This is sort of like a primer. Super interested about this powder this powder can't wait to try it out so 
then the last two items that I'm going to be talking about, my beautiful babies, are two palettes. Where should we start? Okay, let's see. We're going to start by the eyeshadow palette. Of course, for every full face of makeup, we're going to be needing an eyeshadow palette. Right. So, in this occasion, I decided to go for the Milani Gilded Terra. Take a look at this gorgeousness. This is the Hyper Pigmented Eyeshadow Palette or Super Pigmented Eyeshadow Palette. And this palette is just so beautiful. I'm so excited because like I said, this is going to be my first time trying out Milani eyeshadow palettes, Milani products overall. I have tried foundation, a gloss, but I think that's it. That's everything that I've tried from the brand before. It has what I believe is a duochrome, metallics, shimmers, it has matte shades, satin shades, everything. It has this very earth toned golden green purple color scheme that i'm honestly just obsessed that com comes with a mirror very nice size mirror it's very compact very it doesn't it's not very very heavy it has a net weight of nine grams total so it's small it's a small palette but i don't mind as long as it's as beautiful as it looks over here i'm planning to get more i'm honestly my beautiful babes planning to get more milani palettes because they just look so beautiful to me they have a lot of different palettes let's just put it that way with this line of gilded and i just can't wait to get more of those but then i also got another one i also got another one and this one is so special this one is a full face palette and this is face powders eyeshadow palettes this is all-inclusive eye cheek and face palette it is a curated palette of light to medium shades seven richly pigmented and effortlessly wearable shades especially designed to achieve a variety of versatile makeup looks Whoa. the presentation i love this this is so cool so gorgeous it looks really high-end this is what you get when you open it up it comes with a very nice size mirror as well and then you get the color scheme you're gonna have one highlighter it comes with two blushes over here one of them is luminous like the luminoso that is super super famous it reminded me a lot of orgasm from nars this one is matte super beautiful highlighter bronzer and then three shadows to create the perfect eye look and i'm honestly like whoa the eyeshadow looks absolutely beautiful i'm honestly like just cannot wait to dip my fingers in this one because it looks just so gorgeous so beautiful right so this one will have its own video let me tell you just that we're gonna have full face using only one palette but we'll see about that milani but we'll see if we're gonna be able to create such a beautiful look those products from the palette and nothing else all right uh, what else do we have is that it yay that's everything we got <laughs> For my birthday, I mean, I'm a lucky girl, I'm a lucky girl. I'm not only a lucky girl, my beautiful babes, the truth is that I'm a super hard working girl. You know that I do so many different things. I do own a cosmetics mini shop or mini store where I sell a lot of different Mexican products, affordable products. So I try to make the extra buck, you know, I try to hustle, work my ass off to get what I want and I don't get money from YouTube just yet. Hopefully one of these days that'll happen with your help with your views and you know that i'm always hustling and working i'm not doing this just because i want to get money or free products i'm willing to buy them myself you just saw that and you see it in every single video everything that i have was bought by me the one and only joe gomez beauty but i just i've never done a haul before because i never wanted to send the wrong message you know i never wanted you to think that i was just bragging or being superficial or just showing up or flashing things out so you feel that you don't have enough that i don't have enough maybe for some people this is just like random makeup this is very little for a lot of people it, it's a lot so i understand you know i understand that we all come from different backgrounds but one thing that i can tell you is that i started out with nothing 
literally nothing and every single thing that I've gotten here on my channel on my face um, when it comes to makeup my brushes everything was because I worked so hard and I'm still working so hard over them and most of these things for example these products you're seeing right now and over here I want to be super honest with you all I'm gonna be paying for them for a few months I'm gonna be paying for them for a few months so yeah that's the only way for me to get like big purchases originally or initially I was planning to get one Pat McGrath eyeshadow palette, one Mother Shape, and another one from Natasha Denona. But then I thought that I needed more, more makeup just to enrich and enlarge my collection. Not because I want to have the largest collection in the world, but because I love to try. This is part of my job right now. I mean, like I said, I don't get paid, but I don't mind. It is my passion, yes, but it is also a responsibility that I acquired. It is sort of like my job, my third job, fourth job at this point. Kind of like that. So I just wanted to take it seriously and to have a lot of different opinions and perspectives when it comes to makeup And I want you to ask me and I want to be able to answer to give you answers For example, does this concealer perform well? Joe? Yes, it does. Go and get it. No, it doesn't. You should stay away from that You should totally go and get it. You know, I love to try different products different brands all ranges all budgets I just don't care about the brand. I mean when it comes to how expensive or how affordable is I've found great gems in affordable makeup, drugstore makeup, and I've also found great gems in high-end makeup. So it's all about that. Trying new makeup to give you the very best possible recommendations so you can trust in me and we can build a more beautiful and amazing makeup lovers, enthusiasts, beauty lovers, beauty addicts, community like I'm planning to, like I'm hoping, like I'm wishing for, like I'm dreaming about. So this was my little or big or I don't even know how to call it birthday haul of all of the things that I decided to get for this baby over here that happens to be myself my beautiful babes so I just hope that you get a lot of birthday presents and just believe that if you were not able to get as many presents as you would have hoped for do not worry life gets better and if you work hard you're gonna be able to get even more beautiful things I mean this is just like 1% of the things that I want but but it's not all about wanting, it's about earning and it's about making things happen for yourself with your own effort and sacrifice. So I just cannot wait for you to see me that outfit that I got from Shein. I mean, I know that it's such a, an affordable brand, but it's my budget. It's what I can pay for. And if you cannot pay for high end or higher end makeup or clothing or things, do not feel bad. At the end of the day, they're just going to cover your body. They're just going to look kind of the same so i don't have anything designer minus a pair of sunglasses i think and two belts over there but i'm not a huge designer person when it comes to clothing or makeup or purses or bags because i don't have the budget and if one day i have it and if i'm lucky enough to be able to get those things maybe i'm gonna do it but it's just not my main mission in life my main mission in life my main goal and objective is just to be happy to be in good health to share with those whom I love to share with you what I love to do which is makeup and beauty so I just hope that you can welcome me in your hearts I'm getting emotional at this point I have the birthday blues so that happens almost every single year but yeah my beautiful babes we're gonna be stopping here thank you all so so much for watching like I always tell you it means the world to have you here to have your presence so don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not yet done so don't forget to ring the bell to follow me on other social media platforms to Women's Beauty almost everywhere and don't forget to come back next week because we're gonna have amazing surprises you know that my channel is bilingual we have fewer videos in English these days but if you keep watching them and if you keep asking for them trust me I'm gonna keep making them happen for all of you to watch for all of you to enjoy maybe one of these days I decide to have a second channel in English I don't know we'll see about that but in the meantime gracias Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to wish me a happy birthday. And most of all, don't forget that you and I have a date very, very soon, my beautiful babies. Thank you so much for watching.